This is Man Made Media Channel on YouTube. Allow me to introduce you to man. Men can't be hoes. We got Mr. See what you gotta say, men sir. Can't, men can't become hoes. Men men can't become hoes? No. There's no such thing as a male hoe. What do they call them? Just a man being a man. <laughs> that is in the dictionary. <laughs> yeah, no. I mean, so it's actually, it's actually, it, so if you want my, if you want my real, my real outlook, my real outlook is, is it's a male before he's evolved into a manhood, into manhood, right? He just, he just being, he's just being a male. But once he grows and once he evolves, he changes how he changes how he moves and he changes how he operates and he shows up differently in the world. Uh, like when I look at when I look at scripture, scripture ain't got scripture ain't got no word for for a man that's out there dropping his seed off everywhere. But but they certainly have a woman. They ha certainly have a word for a woman that's out there spreading and pop and busting it open everywhere. That is true. That is true. Do we got to go to the old word harlot. Let me stop. Yep. Go ahead. <laughs> that is the word. But but when I talked about everybody go check out my series, I did a show and it was called "If It Up Girl," and one of the elves inside there. We already know that Kevin Samuels, the late great Kevin Samuels, gave us the fit, feminine, and feminine, and fit, feminine, and friendly. But there was a word in there that I continuously tell men to look for inside a woman, and that word is forbearing. And the word, the the extended meaning of that is when a person has the right to has the right to outlash and they are at full privilege to do it, but they refrain themselves from doing it. That is a forbearing person. And I tell men to look for a forbearing woman because you want a woman that's not going to match your anger if you get out of control because with us being men when men get out of control and get angry violence can occur so you want a forbearing woman that's not going to match your anger at any given time or it or or even when you express anger towards her or when you get mad you don't want some woman going to turn up a notch when you go up a notch it takes a forbearing woman to actually step back and say okay he's in his mood and let me use my feminine wild side to get him back calm down because that because a good woman know how to soothe the soul of an angry beast the and zoo women the zoo women would say the best way to get over a man is to get up on another one that is true but a forbearing woman don't do that she knows how to move inside the world she doesn't let a man's actions dictate her actions my wife a man's actions doesn't dictate her actions. my actions won't dictate hers she's going to move steadily and progressive and she's going to move how she always moved i can get buck wild and crazy but she was still steadily move calm, cool, calm, and collect. And come collect me up and say, you need to calm down. Even though she might have the right to be mad. I think men need to, and I think that's one of the qualities that men miss inside women. I'm with him on that. I'm with him on, on, on that. Men get bitches in holes. They can drive them crazy. And when you push a woman to be that, they will go there. Well, you if, if you put your you push a BR hole to do that, they will do that. But you know, when you go out and you get reckless with a real woman, and you let's say you go out and cheat, and she comes to you and she look at you like, oh, you got caught cheating? She ain't gonna fight, she ain't gonna fuck, she gonna just simply pack her stuff and leave. Cause she know who she is. And now you in trouble because you know, because when they ain't fighting and fussing, they leaving. It's over. Hey, I will say this, Mr. Life. I really agree when to you on point. Fed like, up. No, when a woman's fed up, let me tell you why I agree with you, Mr. Life. When it comes to a forbearing woman, I got forty dollars for a woman to bear it all. So you damn right, I need a forbearing woman. <laughs> you hey, need, you for need you. for her to bear it all, huh? Yes, yes. <laughs> so you better be forbearing. Thank Can you, you bear that. it you all, too? Can you, you bear it all? Lot. 